Hi guys, so everybody has been asking me how I dye my gym chalk um, and I was going to um, dye some yellow today so I just thought I'll do a quick tutorial for you. So this is the um, food colouring I use, I just buy them for like a dollar twenty, I think a bottle from the local grocery store um, for the Aussies, Coles, Woolworths. Um, I'm pretty sure you can get them from like Aldi as well, but they're in the form of liquid, they're not gel. And um, I literally just pour them over, so I just soak them in. So I do use a lot of food coloring when I dye my gym chalk. And I'll just turn them over. need to open one more just to get all of them and I don't put these in the dehydrator I just leave them in the um, these tin foils and just sit them on top of the dehydrator so that it kind of like um, still like warms up from the bottom. But um, yeah, if you normally what happens is when I do put them in the dehydrator, they do get a little bit harder. Um, so if you do want it a little bit more crunchy, that's what you can do. But um, yeah, this is pretty much how I do it. So it's a lot of food colouring, I know. But um, it's worth it because the colours just come out amazing. And I'll let this sit on top for like two days. Um, if I do feel like that they're still pretty wet... Um, what I'll do is I might put it in like the dehydrator for about half an hour to an hour. Um, if not, I'll just leave them out for maybe like an extra day. So I hope this helps you guys. And if there is any other requests, let me know and I'll be more than happy to show you guys.